1998 Grady Y263 Chase with a beautiful uh, all grip flag blue hull. This is a really striking boat. Uh, it's just great color uh, with that nice white stripe on it. I mean, it looks great and the hull just looks absolutely immaculate uh, all around. I mean, that's just the reflection of the bus next to it there. It's pretty, pretty incredible. Um, let's take a look at the bottom here. Just bought it painted. The bottom is in great shape. Nothing needs to do here. Silky smooth, just drop it in the water and run. Let's hop on board and take a look. This boat's in really nice shape. Uh, you know, just everywhere you look, all the glass is solid. I don't see any signs of any kind of water intrusion or anything like that. It's really clean. Uh, and uh, if you look here on the back, we've got twin 200 OX66s. These motors are actually year 2000, but was repowered uh, by the original owner, and uh, most likely that was for a little more power options. Get some bigger engines on this boat, so it really goes. It's got the optional live well, recirculating live well, right behind the bolster seat here. Tons of rocket launchers. T-top is also matching flag blue. It's in great shape as well. Uh, come up here to the helm station. We've got chop part of fish finder, combo, Garmin, and nice Horizon stereo system. You can see just everything on it. That windshield, crystal clear. It's got the Isinglass enclosure, which is in nice shape. And uh, just everything on this boat is in really, really nice condition. It's got a windlass on it, which you see here. Uh, of course, we've got meta trim tabs. And uh, everything else you might need. Some VHF there in the electronics box for your lighting. We pop up here to the bow area. <coughs> Cushions are not on the boat right now. This boat is uh, still in winter storage. But uh, what you can really take a look at here is just what kind of nice shape everything is. I mean, you don't see any sign of any kind of water intrusion, rust, or anything that needs to be rebed or resealed. The uh, non skid. Is all in pristine shape all around the boat. Take a look in here. Hatches are smooth, clean. There's your rising glass enclosure in good condition. Take a look over here. You see how clean all these compartments are. You can separate that out. Use one for fish and one for your cold drinks. Pop up here. You've got a secondary anchor, your anchor locker, horizon windlass, plenty of chain on that, which is great, that'll definitely hold, and you've got CQR out front, which is also a plus. I'm going to take a look back here at the console, and you'll again see it's just it's in really nice shape. Most of the boats this age just don't look this good. This boat has been really well taken care of, uh, you know, shrink wrapped in the winters. No cracking, no crazing on the fiberglass or anything like that. I mean, it just it's just in wonderful condition. It does have a console head, which you can see in here. There's actually a ton of room. And uh, it's got a porta potty. Plenty of space. Plenty of storage, too, all over the place and console access. Hop on back here. We've got another bait well right here on the transom. And here's your battery switches on the stern. Everything's really clean. Gunnel storage, wash down, additional storage compartment here that opens up. Tons of storage on this boat, tons of access. You also have cockpit faucet, great feature to have, works great, and that is about it. Uh, that's the boat. One thing that I'd say she does need is, uh, you know, she probably reupholster some of these cushions, 
could probably get away with the season for it, but that's that's really about it. Compared to the others on the market, this is the cleanest one you're going to find. Uh, it's got that nice power option, those twin 200 OX66s. It's the best engine, much better engine than most of these have on them. Uh, and, uh, and that's about it in that beautiful flag blue hull. Uh, nothing like that. You're not going to see another Grady like that on the water. Um, that's it. Great boat. Great boat for summer fun. Fishing with your friends.